What's up, guys? We're here at the Gunter Hotel, the Sheraton Gunter in San Antonio, Texas. And I don't know if you hear the guy behind me, but he said one of the great famous murders happened. If you watch this video, we're gonna go to that exact same room where it happened. I'll give you the story. We're gonna go right now. Anyways, this is listed as both number three and number five, depending on which platform you look at as top 10 most haunted hotels in Texas. Let's go check it. You ready to go? Yeah. All right, guys, we're on the sixth floor and room 636 is supposedly one of the most haunted rooms. The story behind it was in February of 1965, San Antonio's largest unsolved mystery took place at this hotel. Alan Knox checked in on February 6th. There was a lady involved, supposedly a call, a call girl. And on February 8th, the maids opened the door. Adam was reportedly holding a bloody bundle in his arms. He looked at the maid and she said, and he said, shh, with the finger over his mouth. She ran off and took about 40 minutes for everything that you calculated out. And when they got back, the room was completely clear and Alan has never been seen again. He was reportedly seen at the Sears Hotel on February 7th to purchase meat grinders. The entire room was covered in blood. It's from 636. It's not this way. So this is 635. You found it? Yeah. Did our own little adventure. This is it. That is crazy. I wonder if anybody's ever in this room. Wow, so this is where the maid stood and opened the door, or she opened the door, and Alan Knox was standing there holding a bloody sack. And supposedly, we're gonna go check this hotel out. Look at how crazy these nails. Sorry guys, I had to cut that off just because of the, uh, the sound. These are the elevators, they look really, really old. Let me read some more about this hotel for you guys, which is actually really interesting. So, this hotel, 2007, was listed as a U.S. National Register of Historic Places in 1837. Just one year after the fall of Alamo. It stood as a hotel, it went by the name Settlement Inn, was completed in 1909. 